It's about that time again for the new year and I just wanted to share two options with you. On this glitter eye look, one natural, one vampy. Taking my The Bomb Cosmetics Neat Matrimony Palette and I'm going to start with the color Matte Lopez and put that in my crease. Taking the shade Matte Reed to deepen my crease and give it some more definition as well as put it in my outer V. I'm going to continue to deepen the outer V with Matte Ahmed. Because I am going to be using glitter, I don't want it to be messy, so I'm going to take an eyeliner and start to draw the shape, but it wasn't really working, so I just grabbed my NYX Jumbo Stick, and I am drawing the shape of where I want my glitter to be. Because this is my base and it's creamy, I'm going to blend it out with a blending brush. Taking a thin fluffy brush to uh, make sure that there are no lines in between this. Then a big fluffy one for the smooth transition. Going back into Matte Ahmed and applying it all over my eyelid. And giving it one more blend. Taking my Jouer Ready to Wear palette, I'm going to take that and start the base for my glitter. Taking my Too Faced Glitter Glaze, I'm going to apply that all over my lid with my fingertip. Taking Urban Decay Heavy Metal Glitter in Midnight Cowboy, I'm going to take that and apply that on top of the other glitter for some added shine. I'm going to fan the glitter while I'm waiting for it to dry so that way I don't have any creases in my glitter. I'm just wiping away any excess glitter that happened to fall while I was applying. Priming my face with my Becca Liquid Shimmering Skin Perfector in the color Opal. For my foundation concoction, I'm going to take my L'Oreal Infallible 24 hour and my Makeup Forever Ultra HD and just blend that in all over my face. To highlight my face, I'm going to use my Tarte Creaseless Concealer and just hit it on my cheekbones, down my nose, forehead, etc. I'm going to blend out all of my concealer with my Morphe blending sponge. And I'm cleaning up the edges of my highlights with the same Morphe brush I used to put on my foundation. So listen, it's New Year's Eve, we're going to be real extra about everything. I want this highlighter real bright, so I got my Maybelline Fit Me and I'm applying my second coat of concealer. And of course we'll be setting the face with the Holy Grail. Laura Mercier setting powder. By the way, I'm using that mini elf sponge that came in their trio. Now I'm just brushing it off so that it's not too bright. To contour, it's Old Faithful, my NYX Wonder Stick, hitting the cheeks, the forehead, and the nose. And I'm buffing everything out with a damp city color angled contour brush. Taking Anastasia of Beverly Hills Havana and setting all the places where I apply my contour. Taking MAC Studio Fix and setting all over my face, including in between my highlight and contour so there's no harsh lines and it's just a smooth blend. Taking Anastasia Beverly Hills Banana and putting it under my eyes just to make it a little bit brighter. Now for the glow I told you we keeping it real extra. I'm taking the Do Bad and Ofra Cosmetics combination and applying that all over my cheeks. I believe this is You Glow Girl. And then I'm taking the Ofra Beverly Hills highlighter, mixing together that pink and that gold and getting my shine on. Blush, I'm taking Makeup Geek romance and I'm just applying that to the apples on my cheeks. Then I'm setting my contours with some translucent powder. Just brushing it off with a fluffy brush. 
For my bottom lash line, I'm going to take a black eyeliner and just smudge that in for the smokiness. In the black and brown shades to smoke out the bottom lash line. Highlighting my tear duct with the gold glitter glaze. And keeping the glitter movement going with the Urban Decay Heavy Metal. Coating my lashes with MAC Upward Lash Mascara. My lashes are Huda Beauty number 8. I'm lining my lips with like a pinky crown liner. I'm going to fill in my lips with MAC Velvet Teddy. I'm applying a Buxom lip polish in a similar shade. And so this is look one for my more conservative glitter look. So now for look two, which is my absolute favorite, we are going to bring in the Vampy for the new year. So I'm taking a black eyeliner and lining my lip as if it were a lip liner. And I'm filling in my lip with the NYX Jumbo Pencil, you guys. This is essentially like a DIY black lip situation going on here. I'm just taking a lip brush just to smooth it and make sure the product is on the places I want it to be. Taking a pointed Q-tip just to clean up and make sure I have clean lines with this lipstick. I take my glitter very seriously so we're going to apply more on the lip for this look. To mattify this lip and make it stay in place, I'm going to take some 2-ply tissue, pull it apart, and set it with some translucent powder so that your lip stays in place all night. This is the finished look, you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this look. I hope you guys enjoyed both options. If you're not subscribed already, don't forget to subscribe. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Have a happy new year, you guys. Thank you so much for everything this year and for watching. Until then, I will see you in next year. Mwah!